If you're just getting started working with Excel, you might have asked yourself the question, what is Excel used for? On the screen, we're seeing a spreadsheet, and often Excel is described as a spreadsheet package. It certainly is that, but it's a lot more as well. This worksheet is showing us information about sales and expenses for a small operation. Sometimes we're talking about a large company, projecting budget totals, tracking expenses over a variety of months. Excel has all kinds of capability when it comes to tracking and handling financial information, and many Excel users use it for those purposes. But we can also handle database type lists. Here's a list of our customers. Here's a list of our employees. Excel has tools for letting us manage lists like these. We can sort this list in different orders. We can use a filtering process to hide the data we don't need to see. This might just as well be scientific data or engineering data. We can also take smaller amounts of data and quickly convert them into colorful charts. The chart to the right is much more effective during a presentation than the simple numbers that we see off to the left. We also can analyze large amounts of information. This happens to be transactional data. With the pivot table feature, you can quickly come up with a summary, analyze the information in no time at all. Also built into Excel are capabilities you wouldn't exactly expect. One is called SmartArt. There are over 200 different selections available here as well. And tons of visual features, such as the title you see on this worksheet, that allow you to present this material in effective ways. In short, you can use Excel for a variety of different data types, and there are tons of different features in Excel that allow us to manipulate and use this data effectively.